All right, then. Good to go? And with that said, we're back. I guess. Woo! All right, uh... Well, I, I did not press a button. Yo. Game, please. It's always freaking out. No, 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 no. Our take? I, I guess. I need a... I need a new PS3 controller. This thing's busted. How busted are we talking? It's... No, it, well, it's just those weird instances where it just sporadically, like, goes all over the place with menus and stuff. Which no. is... not good. <laughs> uh... Okay, we're going this way. Hmm? Now for the new gunship sections. And this... oh, there's so much better in this game. I agree. And there are things I do like more in the first game, like, it felt more like the Great Sea. Um, in terms of like how you progressed through the world or like through the area and all that, but this is a lot more practical and more fun. Yeah. I like the ship building though and, and one more. Uh. I'm, I haven't had the chance to really see the one in this game, so. I've tried it, I don't understand it. Yeah. And you need it. Make a uh, if you want to do like the optional boss. I just remember like messing around in it one time to make this stupid block monster. So what, Dad? Grab this. Uh, yeah, hang on. Hang on, here. I'm gonna be quiet for a bit. Okay. Where's my silence? Okay. Full speed ahead! Alright, let's see how I do this. Okay, so yeah, this is a lot more fast paced compared to uh, one. There's. Um. It's kind of like just a really fun, fast paced space shooter kind of thing, and it's. Uh, you get. You can get a lot of, um. new gummy shits from just, like, getting good scores and stuff, I believe, so you don't actually. You don't actually have to stick with the main gummy ship and, like, build your own to, like, get good weapons and stuff. You can just play the game normally and not have to worry about the customization at all in this game compared to the first. And, I don't know, it, it's just a lot more fun. It's, it's a lot more frantic. It's just trying to shoot down all the all the uh, enemies and stuff is a blast. And It's a very nice upgrade to the first game and... You only really had to do these one. Um, I'm pr I might do the uh, gummy ship missions and stuff just because I've never really done them before, and it will be interesting to try them out, I suppose. But they, what I do like is that they don't ever force you to do them twice. Like you, you, uh, there's like a um, a uh, gummy ship section before each world, and once you finish that, um, you can go to the world at any, any time. You don't have to do uh, the gummy ship section ever again if you don't want to, and I do like that. And to be fair, like you could just walk um, to the world uh, once you got to there in one, uh, actually got that um, gummy ship navigator or whatever it was. Um, but you know, the way this game does it just makes it a little bit more convenient so you don't have to like sit through uh, some cutscenes of the gummy ship warping to an area and all that, and it's just... It's just a lot more convenient, and these in general are just a lot more fast-paced and fun to play. I'm and, back. You know. I, I overheard all of that, and good is that better? Wait, wait, you, you heard all that? Yeah. Okay. I couldn't, uh... Well, I, I didn't turn off the music, I turned off, I just turned off my microphone. Okay. <laughs> Look at all this. <laughs> Yeah, it gets really hectic. And this is only the first one, keep in mind. Like, some of them um, has have music that you think you'd hear in, like, F-Zero or Sonic. Mm-hmm. In case you didn't notice, at least a good number of these are nobody ships. Yeah, yeah. It really makes it weird when, like, you go into the world, because there's gonna be a severe lack of nobodies. Yeah, I think the most time you'll see nobody's thinking about it is the gummy ship sections. And like, if not a world, final world stuff, yeah. 
Um, the max rank you can get with your medals is 30. Right. It mm. keeps track of your, what your highest one was. What? <sighs> oh, now we're done, but... So do one sec. We're gonna do each gun except if I can before we go to the vault, right? Uh, I guess. Uh, what? Has, how do these, um... Uh, missions work exactly, like... They're different, but I don't know. But, here's, here's the thing, though. These are the only... We're going for the complete journal, but these are the only things that are not required. Yeah, they, 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 this stuff isn't required at all, which is surprising, because this game, like, demands, like, almost everything. But, um... I, I'm kind of curious about these, because I never see... I, I've never seen any of this, like, on videos or anything like that. Fun. Like, I think it's hard. Huh? That's kinda hard. Hmm. Like, d level 2 missions are enemy strikes, destroy a number of ships indicated. Okay. So, 56% so Hmm. Okay. Mission 1, did we, we- did we- is this the one we just did, or...? I think so. Hmm. Yes, you could- number 2 is different track. Alright, uh... Let's do this, I guess. I'm gonna have to be quiet again for a moment. Okay. Okay. I just destroyed 200, I guess. Okay. Uh, but yeah, the general, um, I guess, control layout, uh, uh circles with your draw, um, if you, if you hold down X, you get, like, lasers and stuff, and you just keep tapping, tapping the button to shoot, like, bullets, and, um, that's basically all you need to know, more or less. Oh my goodness. These are ridiculously flashy, by the way. Goodness. <laughs> oh! Wow. Alright. It really speaks for itself, though. Just look at all this insaneness. Look at that bullet hell. Yeah. What was the mission? Uh, just kill a bunch of enemies, I guess. Because I think I tried doing one of these one time, and it's like, it still said mission I am taking a lot more damage than I'd like, though, right now. Well, everything is mentally, I just don't care enough. Because mm. again, they're not required in the play. No, 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 no. But there is actually an optional ball pain ball to the dumb shit. Like, you only fight it on proud mode or above. Oh, wow. Mm. Awesome. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna turn the game down because it's kind of. It's louder than you are. Yeah. Oh. Is that the normal mission? Uh, or the second mission? Uh, this is the second one. C is eh. Come on, bro.
You gotta do a dive again if you want to get the keyblade. Just so you know, Whoa, I'm joking. There's no, there's no real prize. Right. Wait, does this screen always pop up even if you get like the best rank? As far as I know. Alright. Very arcane. Yeah, that, that's what I get. Uh, that's the feel I get from those. Imagine actually like sitting in an arcade. With, oh, you know what'd be cool? What's up? You ever seen like one of those like um those Star Wars arcade scenes where it's like you're in a space where you're doing the spaceship fights and yeah. it looks like you're actually in a high fighter or something like that? Oh, I see. Okay, so imagine like if you're in an arcade, you saw one that looked like the gummy ship. Hmm. I I see I see the rankings on the top right. So I'm assuming like you do the area normally. And then you can get the stuff from the level, uh, the levels, or whatever. Cause otherwise, cause otherwise, uh, level one would have gotten a rank, I assume. Or mission one. Let me just do this quickly. Let's fill out my OCD criteria. I remember in the ASDB playthrough, uh, Matt, uh, Matt by instinct skipped the intro cutscene, and Eli even Elliot, like, told him, like, Hey, come on, we didn't see it! And then he actually backed out just to show it. <laughs> He's Matt's courteous. Uh, collect medals, what? I've never done this there before, so... Those glowing medals are the, uh... Are the big ones. Right. I think those big glowing ones were added actually to the final thing. Right. Actually, um, when Cyrus was surprised, like, didn't he actually perfect these as well? He tried perfecting these? Because Cyberman 5 is the guy from Kingdom Hearts. Oh, okay. Those those Please. ones I want to get. Um, yeah. Didn't he like uh, manage to avoid uh, Zach's Omni uh, slash or whatever without uh, using? He yeah, completely avoided it. Without yeah, without using um Finger my big short lock. Yeah. I don't know how. Yeah, because like Terra has like the crappiest dodge roll in existence. And he's the one who has to deal with the Omni Slash. Yeah, you'd think they'd give that to, like, Arcor or Ven, honestly. Well, in the arena, when you're in the uh, arena, that you can- you remember we fought him like that. Yeah. We were back in the Mirage Arena, he, like, there was a du double fight with, um, Hades and Possessed Zack. Oh. See, I, I- I barely even remember any of the Mirage Arena stuff, to be honest. Except for maybe like their their own unique bosses. I remember, uh, yeah, I remember the uh, Erica's armor thing, and the uh, monstro. The, I remember the Mimic Master uh, unverse, the one that had the book and that was caught and it made a copy. Yeah, I kind of remember that. I remember one where it was like get uh, the treasure chest thing, uh, like the mimic. Yeah, 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 yeah. You want to watch out for the for the glowing ones in particular. Those are the ones that drop more rare rare pieces. Right. Yeah, but I I, I mean these these are fun, fun enough. I don't think the like that it's gonna be Star Fox or anything like that anytime soon. But it's still like as like a side thing on top of like what the main game is. I think it's a nice little side thing. Hmm. Oh, I just got a message from work, by the way. For, hey, I'm gonna be good for uh, for uh, Thursday to uh, for, from Friday to, mo to next month until next Monday. I'm gonna be uh, available. Nice. Okay, so we got at least an A, I think. <laughs> Mission level three. Okay. Yeah, you unlock the level three mission. Yeah, apparently. Um, these are kind of um. Intriguing though, I like this. Skins, for all good. Do you want? Do you just want to move on, or you want to keep doing the mission? Uh, I, I feel like we should just get them done while we're here. I guess we're each part. We're gonna have a part dedicated to each the gummy section. Probably. All right, where's mission oh. three? Hi. Oh, okay. Just high school runs. All right. Contrary to probably the invincible is not. <laughs> uh. I think I'm not completely sure, but I think the invincible has like a has second chance. Mm. 
Invincible. I, I don't know. Phenomenal cosmic power. Yeah. Let's go. I, I was quoting Donald from uh, the uh, going Quackers or Quackersack game. Alright. Um, I don't know if it's in the PS. The um. Oh. The hell was that? Okay. Um, I I don't know if it's in the PS One or N Sixty Four version, but the GameCube version has this system where uh, you jump on three enemies and press I think R and then input like a bunch of um uh buttons and you'll get this animation of like Donald doing doing something silly and it makes you invincible for a certain period of time and he just goes like invincible. What you mean like you mean like when you have a milkshake? Uh, no, that's, uh, that's, that's something else. Um, that's in the GameCube one as well, but, um, uh, th this basically, like, legit, legitimately just makes you, like, invulnerable, wow. in invulnerable for a set period of time and thanks for all the points game. Um, and it has, like, a, di a, its own music piece. Although, I don't think there's any real reason to do the, the, um, to use the barn combinations that are more confusing. Um, I don't think like it really makes any difference. So you can just do the most basic ones and you'll still get the same effect anyway. Get off the screen! <laughs> oh my goodness! I can't see! <laughs> At least you got the fire. This is... What, yeah. Ah! This is pretty bullet hell. Crazy. Our rank's at one. Zero. <laughs> We're gonna die! This is nuts. I don't think I've ever died on these. Remember, the green pieces are a health when you find them. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I can barely, like, keep track of all this. I've never seen this! No, me neither. I'm so used to the first session, to the regular session. Da! What is going on? I can't see! Oh ah! my goodness, what is happening? Oh, okay, we're oh, just... I guess we made it. <laughs> that is probably crap, yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah, no, we're not doing that. Yeah, I think it's safe to leave out the gummy ship. Yeah. That's just a- let's just show that as the proof of what's going on. Yeah. Alright, now it's actually- Oh, by the way, forever- when I said this, the, the proud mode gummy ship boss, that's only for the fun on the gummy ship session that leads to the final world. Hmm. You know, I'll, I'll try- <laughs> I'll ch see if I can actually fit- uh, finish that off screen. The boss? Or actually get a not- Actually, complete the mission. Alright. Welcome to our first new world of, of the series. Indeed. For, for, a bit, for, for this game, rather, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. See that Mulan? It's Shan Yu, leader of the Hun army. Come on, girl. This is your big chance. I can see it now. Famulan, whoops, public enemy number one. You're gonna be famous. I'm talking A-list. Mushu, I'm not sure. Why did you like evil dragon talking like this? Yet. Yeah. I have to take my father's place to preserve the Fa Fa honor. I just hope I don't get discovered. Whatever. You're just scared. Admit it. Aren't you? <laughs> oh, man. Mm. Ooh. I wonder if that's actually her original voice from Mulan. Mm. Uh -huh. Let's get the jump on him. Gorge. Maybe we better look before we leap. Yeah, let me look it up. Actually, always the voice of reason. Mm. <laughs> 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 what? Mushu? Right. That's right. I know you heard of me. I'm little lethal <laughs> and legendary. Now y'all scram before I get my dragon dander up. Hey Mushu, we missed you. Yeah, well you better hope I miss you, or else you're you're 
Sora, Donald, Goofy. Another one for the counter. Another one for the counter. Man, we used to kick all kinds of bad guy butt together. If we're gonna even be bothered to edit that. Because I'm a mighty dragon, right? I'm not keeping track for the record. Something like that. And you are? Ming na wen. I'm a Let's see. No, I, I, I mean, ping. Yep, that's the original voice. Just Ping. I am Ping, son of Bazu. You know Mushu? <laughs> Mushu's <laughs> one of my family's guardians. We didn't know we were borrowing somebody as important as a family guardian. Yeah, that's right. And that puts you three up to your eyeballs in debt to Ping here. Well, guess what, kiddies? It's payback time. Mushu. Ah, they don't mind. Ain't that right? Hmm, sounds fair. See, Ping here was just on his way to join the Imperial Army. We gotta go find the other recruits over at the training camp. Uh, just so you know, that's not, uh, it's not, it's not the actual original voice for, um, for Mushu. Okay. What do you mean, fit in? Well, uh, uh, don't, don't worry about that. You're pretending to be a see. boy, aren't you? Goofy's a smart one again. <laughs> You're a girl? Yeah. Uh. You didn't notice? Uh, nope. Oh, New Line, someone else done? I think it's working. No, no, Mulan's the original oh, no. one. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Who's you? It's not Eddie Murphy. I'm right hmm. here. And it's the same guy who does thank you for every single thing that's not the movies. Well, the guy Correct. does a convincing enough role in this game, I suppose. Oh, light like voice. But the land of dragons. Yeah, boy. I love the music here, by the way. Yeah, I love the, uh, I love the, uh, like, the actual, like, instruments they're going for with this one. Uh, do we need Donald or Goofy? Uh, actually, uh, hmm. Goofy has Valor form, but... You might as well keep, I think we should yeah. keep Valor for now. Yeah, that's the only one we have. Uh, do I need any of this, um... Hmm. Um, this is one of our first instances where a party, where the optional party member is locked into your team for now. Uh, remind me what damage control is. Reduce it, as it says down there. When you, it, your damage is oh. had when you're when you're in peril. Okay, that's gonna help. Okay, uh, I was thinking of switching Star Seeker and Kingdom Key, but I'm not well, gonna bother. You can't, well, you can't switch them until you get a new Keyblade. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, right. Okay. Right. Uh... Yeah, Mulan's gonna be stick is using the pink persona. You might want to give her the potions at least to use yeah. on you. Yeah, yeah, because like last time we just got wrecked, and we kind of need as many potions as we can, I guess. Right now, uh, oh yeah, we have fire right now as well. Fire after um beating after being off those um under, uh I almost had reversed um. <laughs> uh, technic attack. Uh, that doesn't really matter, I guess. No, actually, wait a minute. Maybe we don't need. Well, we might. Let's think about like this about um about power form. We already yeah. grinded it. We already got to its current max level. That's true as well, but it could also just help in general situations sometimes. It's like uh, an early game, because like... Uh, you know, our combo potential isn't the best at the moment, so... Right. Uh, Aethers could help. Right. Um, I think... Why, why would not we have fire? I might, and this one works more. This one works very differently compared to Kingdom Hearts One. Yeah. This time it's a ring around Sora. Right. And this, uh, it's very good for like general crowd control and um, stuff like that, and it's a lot more useful uh, in general. I find I find myself using this version of fire a lot more than the other, uh, the other like just like uh, shotgun kind of thing. Well, well, it's more like the poom poom, whereas Blizzard yeah. with a shotgun more like it would spread. Right, right. This uh, this is how it works in this game. Oh it's... yeah, I have to keep part two. Is the part is the party is is a is a party switch. You don't have to go to a uh, to a save point anymore just to switch out. Yeah, it's just very useful. You don't have stuff like um, uh, Trinities and stuff to worry about, but it's nice if you want like a certain limit or a uh, drive form, and you can just do that on the fly. Uh, anything you have that's good? Well, there's a lot of fire going on. I know fire immunity is probably going to be our best bet for now. 
Right. Because like most most of the um most of most of the heartless around here will, will be, if they have any elemental besides dark, it's fire. Yeah. No, I'm good. That's it. The enemies around here are pretty are pretty aggressive. Yeah. Um. One in particular. Is, yeah, um... but we're not gonna see that one in for a while. Right. Yeah, just, just, for, just for my own sake, I'm gonna get a list of Kingdom Hearts 2, um, Heartless. Right. I do remember mo a good number of the new ones, but, uh, just in case. Yeah. Alright, cool, let's go. Let's see Heartless. Now, here's the problem we have with Ping. Two left feet. Yeah, uh, cause... Trying too hard. Try and try not too hard to fight like a like a man, and it just doesn't go well. And I, man, getting high jump so early just feels so good. I like this cutscene though. Yes. <laughs> I think. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how it did in the movie too. No. Okay, I think I found it actually. I'm gonna find the one particular heartless though that's gonna be here. Smoked. Wonder what they're searching for lunch today. Naco sandwiches. It's goop. No. Ballard. Please. <laughs> Please. Just Donald. What a girl. Oh, knock it off. Knock what off? You punched me. What a Back shrimp. Back off. <laughs> that's, a, that's what you made one of your things on Twitch, isn't it? Yeah. Let's just get back in line, okay? Back. Well, what was that for, Egg? I, I don't sold. remember. Soldiers, get back in line. I need to change the uh, man Luigi thing because that goes on for too long. <laughs> Donald, did you see Donald? <laughs> yeah. Donald just cracks me up in general. <laughs> what are they? Heartless. And now we have it, and besides the um. The fact that we have to do with pings being being clumsy. There's another gimmick. All right, in, yeah, in this part, you know. Is that is it start right now, actually. Yep. Morale. So pause the game. I'll tell you every time the morale gauge show up. Pause the game so you'll know what what drains it. All right. Every time it gets hit, and, and the meter's gonna go down. So keep an eye on it. If that meter goes down, it's game over. Right. So just pick up the balls and stuff. New Heartless. Nightwalkers. They're based off of some Chinese Sean ghosts, I think. But right. watch out when they do an attack, because they'll juggle you and keep you going for a while. Right. Plus they're the high plus, plus the plus the rabbit they'll stick in the air if they can. Boom. Oh. Yeah, that's the easy part of it. There, there's a lot more. Like I said, also with um. Yes, you can kind of count that to it as a for the count. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Did, did I have to be voiced? Uh, I'll excuse this one. Okay. I don't know if we can count when I say and goofy. <laughs> it's usually Sora, Donald, Goofy. Like 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 each one's a sentence fragment. Hmm. Okay, fun fact actually, one of the first few times, I, the first time I seen Kingdom Hearts 2, they were in, in my, I think it was at a friend's place. Right. They got it on, and they were in Land of Dragons, and I, and I don't remember Mulan that well. Hmm. So, I was confused about what was going on at this point. <laughs> I remember my, uh, my brother walked in when I was playing through Land of Dragons, and he was just like, Oh man, this is just like the movie. Yeah. You know, a Donald Duck. Yeah, of course. 
Sick of a witch. They're not freaked out. Well, then again, well, then again, yeah, Mulan like, has, but, but Mulan has the excuse with, with having Mushu around. Yeah, I, I never thought about that. That's true. Sir. <laughs> uh, so funny when that's just put up in text. Yeah. Oh, by the way, there's a ni something really funny. With, with some nice little de attention to detail of the movie. Look up that pole right there. Yeah. There's the arrow still there. Oh, huh. <laughs> nice to play him now. Um, you All can right. talk to any of you guys around here, you'll learn some stuff. Yeah. Uh, if you you have to do a few missions for a little bit. Talk to Shen if you wanna. Yeah, we have to do that to actually move on with the the game. We're not gonna be able to get that puzzle piece up there until we get at least a higher jump or a glide. Uh, maybe an aerial dodge. Maybe. Let's, try, let's do. We'll let's just do them in order. Right. After this, though, let's head out into the area because there could be. Uh, I think there's items. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Pause the game as soon as you can. Into the time This okay. one's time based. Okay. Just kill them as fast as you can. There's 15 heartless red here. I'm worried if you try going drive right now, you might trigger it. Hmm. Watch uh, that's right. Your... Uh, I think we're fine. It still uh, has the problem of load times, but still. Little advice, by the way, is um because like things are still going around while it's happening. If you pause the game and then wait yeah. a little bit, then it'll it'll catch up. Right. Yeah, yeah you can do that. Um, I, I I'll probably I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna resort to that in like um later stuff, but like I don't think it is too bad at the moment, like early game. But we'll see. I could be eating those words. Just, just clarify again, because we already maxed out um Valor form, so any, all these hits are not experience points for now. Yeah. And sometimes, like, just go into a, like, a drive or summons, uh, because they come back as well, um, is, can be helpful just for their general, like, abilities. Especially, wanna... like... I... Sorry, if you want to drive again, you, may, you might as well head back up in order to quickly recharge it. Alright. Is that up here, or...? No, that's way back to the checkpoint. We're here! No, we're not. <laughs> what was a good... I wonder how we actually feel like running with that kind of style. Yeah. Hi. Uh, the only thing that's annoying about this is that you have to go through the loading screens over and over. Yeah, thank you, thank you, H thank you, PS4 version. <laughs> yeah, it's like a Rayman Legends and PS4. It's like the yeah, non-existent. You were surprised by that. You don't even see like the load screen areas. It just, it just, it's instant. Yeah. That's the PS4's power showing, I guess. Uh, the, the, well, the, there's also a downside that you don't get a heart uh, from the loading screens, though. Can you get the hearts even in single player? Uh, like in the, when you start a level and stuff? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh, I don't know if it's in Origins, but it's definitely in Legends. Head back to the checkpoint, because there's some items up there. Yeah. Speaking of items, though, like, um, compared to the first game, um, this is, it's a lot easier to, like, find where all the chests and, like, puzzle pieces and, like, collectibles are, because, like, um, there's, like, benefits and, uh, and, uh, problems to the, the way this game's designed, because, like, you see, the, the way, like, treasure chests are laid out is usually around, like, cor like, the corners or, like, the sides of the rooms and stuff, and it's, they're easy, easier to spot, um, but you know, sometimes that also causes the issue of some uh, being a lot flatter compared to areas in one. Yeah. So it can't, you kind of have uh, um, you got some good stuff and you have to take some bad with it, I guess. Right, because like the consequence of like the the uh, in level design is, yeah. like you said, flat and and you know it's not as 
unique, yeah. really. It's streamlined like, design, but sometimes to a fault. It's especially a bit more evident when we get to the, uh, with the arena combat we're going, we were talking about.